Tony Campola shares this story about being in a church in Oregon where he was asked to pray for a man who had cancer. Tony prayed boldly for this man's healing. And it was about a week later that he receives a phone call from the man's wife. And she said, you prayed for my husband. He had cancer. And when Tony heard her using these past tense phrases, he thought to his mind, man, the cancer has been eradicated. But before he could think about it much, she said he died. Now, Tony felt terrible. But she continued, don't feel bad. When he came to church that Sunday, he was filled with anger. He knew that he was going to be dead in a short period of time, and he hated God. He was 58 years old, and he wanted to see his children and his grandchildren grow up. He was angry that an all-powerful God didn't take away his sickness and heal him. He would lie in bed and curse God. The more his anger grew towards God, the more miserable he was to everyone around him. It was an awful thing to be in his presence. But the man's wife continued to tell Tony, he said, after you prayed for him, a peace had come over him and joy had come into him. Tony, the last three days, she said, have been the best days of our lives. We sung together, we laughed together, we read scripture together, we prayed together. Oh, these have been some wonderful days, she said. And I call just to thank you for laying your hands on him and praying for his healing. And then she said something pretty profound. She said, he wasn't cured, but he was healed. 